Okay. Coach Soto. <laughs> right? Yeah? Right. right. We, uh, first off, uh, what do you think of the, the dual format today and the rally scoring? Does it encourage guys to score points? Definitely think it encourages uh, people to score points. It's a lot of fun, a lot of excitement. You can win by criteria the whole duel. Somebody gets pinned. It's a ball game, right? Yeah, yeah. That's 12 points, I think, for the pin. Yeah, 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 yeah. Looking at guys, there's guys putting 20, 25 points on the board, and then their team gets 20, 25 points. Yeah. But the losing guy still gets however many points he scores. You know, you look at that. It is encouraging a lot of action today. I've seen a lot of high flyers, a lot of a lot of yeah. four pointers. It's fun to watch people score points. I like it. And yeah, it's definitely. I don't like definitely. watching guys tie, but I like people. You know, I've seen a lot of like 15, 12 matches. Um, do you think that we could draw more fans with that? I do. Yeah, I think it's it, this is fun to watch. It's entertaining. Um, there's no chess match matches. I think everybody's going out and trying to rack points up, trying to score for their team. Yeah, I've watched, uh, I think King just uh, was down in a match here, mm -hmm. came back, stormed back, scored 14 unanswered points. Look at a match like that, that's a guy, he's down early, gets inside truck twice, comes back and just puts a boatload of points yeah. on the board. You're never out of the match. I like that. Match, I sure. saw another guy, a compound guy, down by 19 to 10. Yeah. Pins the guy. You know, those are just crazy matches. Uh, looking at wrestling in the South, you're from Florida. Mm -hmm. Wrestled at UTC. Yep. Um, how much better has high school wrestling gotten from when you're in high school to now? Uh, I think it's growing. Um, Georgia's doing a very good job. Uh, a lot of studs are coming out of there. Um, Tennessee's coming on the rise. Alabama is, is putting it together, and I think programs are starting to, to figure it out. And, tell the north to watch out. I'm going to tell you, I was at the Dvorak this winter, and I watched Lake Highland Prep put it on a bunch of Illinois and Iowa teams. Yeah. They, I mean, they had seven finals. They were, do you think that's the trend of high school wrestling in the South? I do. I do. I think it's going, it's, it's, um, it's been a slow progression, but I think it's starting to pick up, and South is starting to get some momentum, and uh, it's definitely fun to watch, for sure. As far as Chattanooga, do you get in and wrestle with your guys anymore? I can't. Um, just been busy with work and stuff like that. What do you do now? Uh, I work at Hydrosport. Okay. Hydrosport Custom Boats. Yeah. yeah. What's the real world like? It's a little bit different than wrestling, <laughs> but uh, <laughs> but it's it's a lot of fun. It is. The barn. Tell me about the barn. I took a, a tour today. I stayed there last night. What's the barn all about? Tell me about the barn. Um. So Shane and I uh, just thought it'd be a good idea to have a central location where kids can come have fun get great wrestling in and uh, I think that's one way to grow the sport is have, like it's, it's fun to get better but it's also fun to have fun off the mats or it's important I think and um, it's definitely definitely been uh, beneficial for sure around here um, just getting good competition uh, good training stuff like that this kid's tough Cody. Yeah, I like yeah. him. You're coaching him today. Yep. He had a tough match today. He did. He's only a sixth grader. Yep. And he's a guy that you'll be able to work out with probably for the next five, six years. Oh, yeah. Is that something that'll keep you around wrestling, you think? Yeah, for sure. It's it's kind of hard to get away from wrestling. I think anybody that's wrestling knows that. It's like the mob, isn't it? It is. <laughs> you try and get out and they pull you right back in? Yep, yep. <laughs> uh, looking forward to the future. Is this something where you're going to stick with coaching? You're, you're selling, or you're, what do you do with boats right now? What do you do? Uh, so I manage uh, quality at Hydrosport. Um, just make sure the boats are coming out. Uh, they make like yachts, don't they? Stuff. They don't make like, yeah, they're, uh, it's not a boat for a guy like me. No, they're uh, definitely interesting customer base. He's, I think we sold one for two point two million. Um, Is that out. all? Yeah, it was. Uh, <laughs> so it, you know, it's a higher, it's a higher, higher end boat. boat. It's, uh, it's a yacht. Consoles. Yeah, uh, the customers usually they'll tow it on the back of their eighty foot yachts or hundred foot yachts, stuff like that. So really? These are their toys. <laughs> Looking at, you know, but like sticking with, you know, there, there's a, there comes a fork in the road. Mm. Is wrestling always going to be a part of your life? I think so. Yeah. It's, I mean, obviously. Yeah. Yeah. You yeah. can't get rid of those ears, can you? Uh, but, um, no, it's just a great sport to be involved in. And a lot of great principle, principle based stuff uh, to learn in the sport. And I think, I know my kids are definitely going to wrestle and uh, good all around. 
tell me about the barn. You guys aren't running camps. It's not like a for-profit thing. Shane is pretty adamant about not being like making a ton of money. He wants the best competition there. Is that right. something that's going to draw guys? Do you think you're going to get guys down here to Cleveland, Tennessee to work out, get the best workout partners for, yeah. for Cody? I definitely think so. You know, we don't do it for the money. We do it for the love of the sport. And, uh, you know, as a coach, I want to see kids grow, grow in the sport and grow as humans. And um, I think it's important that they can come to a place, have fun, and, and and wrestle hard. You know, there's no pressure from, there's no outside pressures. It's, let's get a good workout in and let's have some fun.